damn it. Open the door! Tell us! Fuck. What the fuck was going on in there? Why did you lock me out? I asked you a question. What did you lock me out for? Were you telling Calvez the day he was killed? What? You heard me. Did he compromise his cover and were you telling him as a result of that? You talked to them after I left? The moss broke off the floor? To Kobe's ID and badge? You heard them? They're claiming Calvez supplied them with stolen police issue to make jump buys. Now can you explain that? Because I'm having a hell of a lot of trouble figuring that out. Exactly. How long after I left did you let those liberal steerings and you spilled all over the fucking floor? I don't like the position I'm in. I don't like where you're putting me to ask these questions now. Were you following him? It's not an indictment if you did. But if you did, I need to know. And I need to know that now. No, I was not telling him. But you were there before he died. You were there before he died. Tell me I'm wrong. You want to fucking talk? All right, we'll talk. Mike was making a bus that morning. He had enough going against him to make an arrest, but he needed backup. Off roster. Why? Because he wanted to bring him in on his own. So I stayed back. I waited. And the buy went bad. Then how come you can identify those guys and they're running Because away? they shot him and ran. They shot him or you shot him as they fled the scene. What did they say to you? That motherfucker Oak started shooting. He shot Calvis. He killed Calvis. Are you out of your fucking mind? As much as he meant to me? You're gonna question my integrity? My commitment to that kid? You got those fucking low-life pieces of shit smear it's that? Huh? Us. We're bringing them in. We're taking them in. You are fucking with something you cannot possibly understand. We're bringing them in. It's over now. Fucking joke. You're a fucking joke, you know that? Your career's a fucking joke. Complete fucking washout. You pop that needle freak in the park, and the process at that fucking woman with a stray bullet costing her Enough. bouncing baby. Fucking her up for life. Enough, stop. Shut the fuck up. You're Come a lie. On. Come on. You're a fucking lie. I got this from child welfare. Catherine Tunney. Mother deceased, was removed from the custody of her stepfather in Myron Cobb, November 23rd, 1985. Declared ward of the state, placed with foster parents. Do you know that little girl? Lieutenant? I think you do. They sealed her records until she was 18. I know you wanted to adopt her. She was in and out of trouble for years and years. In and out of foster homes. Handful of arrest, mostly drug related. You had them all squashed. You bailed her out of rehab lots of times. And she was a minor. You needed a doctor to sign the release. So who did it? Your old pal Harlan. He signed her out of all those clinics, see? I saw the signatures. Shit. You made sure Harlan was acting me on the Calvez case, didn't you? Didn't you? So you doctor the autopsy, right? Alter the lab reports? Make them look clean? Make Calvez look clean? He's as dirty as you are. A filthy, fucking, needle-ridden junkie. And you fucking knew it, you motherfucker. You motherfucker, I'm calling this thing right now. Gun and shield on the ground. Now. I am so far from fucking with you. You're putting a gun to my face? Threatening my life? I'm gonna take your life. Gun and shield on the ground, now. Fucking lie. You just want me to back your bullshit. Sell your store so you can railroad this poor pricks in there. The door won't close till you stop moving.